38117. This is East Memphis. Um, this is one of the areas. Um, if I were a young college grad in Memphis and I uh, went to work for Crest Core Realty and I was an executive here or whatever, it 38117 would be an area I would look in if I were first time home buyer. Yeah. Uh, maybe uh, either no family or kids or just starting a family. I think that's a good area. Uh, investors really love it because of uh, any tenant base there is typically a college grad, um, uh, typically somebody that is working inside the city, working yeah. around and wants to be affiliated with the city. It's extremely trendy and popular. Uh, because you're so close to everything. Park Avenue runs right through this area. Mm -hmm. Park, uh, Quince. Poplar. Poplar. Um, some of the other streets. Cherry. Walnut Grove. Walnut Grove. Yeah. I don't know if Walnut Grove hits 3120 yeah. yet. Does that push 120? Is it 117? Barely, barely. Okay. So 117 is going to be a little bit higher end. Uh, uh -huh. These are going to be brick homes. I don't mm -hmm. know that you're going to see many siding or anything at all there. Mm -hmm. They're mostly going to be three bedrooms. You get siding in 117? Colonial Acres? No. Well, not that no. I'm remembering. All right, no. here's our numbers, our details. Um, year to date, get a load of this. From January 21 to July 31st, 619 sales. It's our highest one so far. Average square feet, you can, 1,900. And our average sales price is 305,000. Okay, that's that's high. I don't think you're gonna have to pay that to get into I mean, they're, they're, they're Colonial they're, Acres million million five two million dollar houses that are influencing three this. in three eight one one seven yeah yeah now they're not a lot but that's what's pulling this way up correct there i mean there's a there's some pockets of nice rental properties where you can get in for good value 140 to two hundred thousand dollar range yes right in yeah. that colonial acres yeah awesome. so if you're looking at a map you could say park for your north border uh Cherry, would you go that far? Yeah. Okay. okay. So Cherry on the west, and estate two forty, whatever. Two forty on the east. Yeah. And, and then, then south. Quince Willow. two forty. Yeah, two forty. Willow. Somewhere in there. Yeah. That pocket. Now, three eight one two seven. Three eight one one seven goes north of that, but it's it's mostly owner occupied. Is we we manage a few hand, like, you know, a couple in there, a few in there that. People move. It's going to be and, tough to get even your one you, percent. You're not going to get the one percent, yeah. but but you're going to get the appreciation and the store of value that some people want. So compared to a year ago, the appreciation. Let's give that out in one one seven. Speaking of that, so a year ago to from Jan one to July thirty first, five eighty five sales. It's uh -huh. about on track. Same square feet, two fifty six. So you can look. There's a fifty thousand dollar jump on average sales price from there. Um, from a year ago, I, I still don't think you're going to have to spend 250 or 300 no. grand to get a rental on 38117. There's no. going to be plenty of opportunities to go from the 140, 150 range to 200, 220. Yes. But you're going to get a, you know, some parts of Memphis, you don't want to factor in the appreciation. Yeah. But you can in 38117. I agree with I that. And you are going to get appreciation in 38117. I think you'd agree that the tenant base is super strong. Solid. It's a it's a stable area. It's been that way. It I mean, there are legacy schools and religious institutions that aren't moving, you know, have planted yes. deep, deep, deep roots. Yeah. So people want to live Over in there. this area, this part of town. Yeah. And they've really done a ton of commerce redevelopment along poplar which is just north of the park and mm. it's it's a very hot desirable great place to live i'm even seeing some that on park on park yeah, they've, building, totally they've, they've redone the whole eastgate yeah, shopping yeah, center yeah, yeah, they've yeah. Redone the whole torchy's thing. tacos just opened across the street where bogey's used to be i still it's can't packed. get in yeah we had to wait 40 minutes oh, anyway man. so i mean great stuff happening in 38117 yeah so 